we do just like in the 40s and 50s where they had like radiation rings and stuff like oh get your radiation ring it's really good for you it enhances your health and it cures cancer and stuff obviously giving you cancer that's what it's going to be like it's going to say it's we're going to say things like the fda said that was heart healthy the fda said that was good for you the fda said the rda of vitamin c was what we're going to be taking hundreds of thousands of the rda of these vitamins and nutraceuticals and it's going to be like no big deal no one's even going to ask questions Nobody, at that point we're going to understand it's going to be like knowing that drinking water is good. We're going to be like, we drank water with what in it? And you, would you, right, right. Granddad, you'd really turn on a tap and pharmaceuticals would be in your water? What the heck? You know, I think and arsenic, the, the number yeah. one cancer causing and the most right. toxic chemical, fluoride, number two toxic chemical known to man was in your water supply. It's like Rome. What was going on? Pipes. They had no idea. Mm -hmm. And some people would say, hey, maybe we shouldn't use these lead. Uh, lead constructs to, to funnel all the water through it. Maybe that's why we're going insane, not to mention we drink two two bottles of wine every night. And we're like, oh, shut up. You're insane. You don't know what you're talking about. That's how that's how I feel right now. I feel like it's at a certain point we're just going to realize what's going on. A clean, toxic-free body is the foundation of true health. Introducing Deep Cleanse by InfoWarsLife.com, a scientifically formulated blend of nanocolloidal zeolites and organic ingredients that aid the body in cleansing chemicals and toxic metals. Using our proprietary multi-step extraction technology, Deep Cleanse is our most affordable all-in-one cleanser. With concentrated organic compounds like cilantro, milk thistle, fulvic acid, orange peel, zeolites, and others, Deep Cleanse doesn't hold back. Instead of buying five, six, or even seven different cleansing products. We use decades old scientific research to put together the Rolls Royce of all-in-one cleansing. Look, there's a reason Deep Cleanse is the only product on the market that uses our proprietary Spigerex herbal processing technique. We use only the highest quality organic herbs backed by serious research and we still bring it to you at the best price out there. If you wish to find Deep Cleanse and experience the all-in-one cleansing, visit InfoWarsLife.com. That's InfoWarsLife.com or call 888-253-3139. Knockout is back. If you want a product that has 10 known ingredients that naturally get your body to relax, your brain to relax, so you get deep, restful sleep, knockout's it. Infowarslife.com. L-theanine, hops flower extract, lemon balm extract, valerian root extract, chamomile flower extract, L-tryptophan extract, melatonin, and more. All organic, all the natural sources. It's the same price as leading brands of melatonin that are three milligrams a piece. It has three milligram, the standard recommended dose for an adult. It's got the GABA. So it would probably cost $50 to take all this as separate pills. It's $19.95. You take one or two of these and it just is really clean, restful sleep is what the reviews are. It's what I've experienced. And it just synergistically puts everything in there. Visit InfoWarsLife.com. That's InfoWarsLife.com. Or call 888-253-3139. Go and grab mine. Hey, at InfoWars, we are pro-Second Amendment. I mean, there's no way around it. No ifs, ands, or buts. And speaking of guns, Head Down Rifles has been pretty much amazing since we've taken them on as a sponsor. These guys make really awesome rifles. And in case you don't know, you're just now tuning in. Uh, this rifle right here is a one-of-a-kind Triton 10 head-down rifle. It's got a custom uh, paint job done to it, and it has Alex Jones' signature and mine as well. And it's really a sturdy, stable, light weapon. Uh, it, it goes for about $1,500 just like this. Now, if you give $1,000 or more, your name is automatically entered in for a chance to win this head-down rifle with the actual Georgia Optics site that'll go on top. We'll have more information on that later as well. So I want to encourage you to donate. Help us out here at InfoWars.com so Jakari Jackson and Josh Owens can go and to Arkansas and interview Larry Nichols. And if you didn't see that uh, documentary earlier, that was really powerful, really amazing, great Very job. Well made. By, yeah. uh, I mean, I was there. I keep trying <laughs> to say a great job. I was there while Josh shot it and then came back and did the master edit so i give the credit to josh owens on that one but uh yeah you know 
we do a lot of stuff. I like to go shooting. You spend a lot of time at gun ranges as well. You just recently bought a brand new Glock, didn't you? Yeah. And too. like the last caller from Croatia said earlier, people in America take that freedom that we have for granted. I think people should go out, go to gun shows. People are so scared. They're so paranoid about guns. Like, guns kill people. Well, no, people, people kill. I, if, I don't know. Maybe they can get a shot of this desk. We have three guns on the desk in... Not one of them notice, shot us. Uh, yeah, no, no guns have jumped off the desk and shot us. Is there a way to get an overshot real quick? And I can assure you guys that at no point during this broadcast is this magazine by itself going to load itself into this firearm, nor that one into that one, and then go on a mass shooting spree. That does not happen. That happens with people who have ill intent or people who are not properly trained. And, you know, it's, it is unfortunate that accidents happen, but do you ban a car every time there's a car accident? Of course not. And you're much more likely to be killed in a car accident going about your day-to-day -day business. It's liberal logic. People always want to blame the tool and not blame the person. People don't ever want to hold the individual accountable for their actions. And that's what we keep seeing time and time again. Like you said, it takes a person with ill intent, ill will, someone who wants to do harm to do that. Now, regardless of the fact that the government comes in, they're trying to take your guns, you know, they come in and grab all the guns up like they did in Katrina. Mm -hmm. If you wanted to go out and do something, you still have that ability you have that hate in your heart. You can go grab a rock, a hammer, whatever it is yeah. like that. We can't start banning everything because a few bad people out there make bad decisions. And does that mean that we have this huge escalation or spike in gun violence right now? I don't really think so. I think everything's pretty much the same as it's always been since there's been guns around. The fact is that we have social media now, and the mainstream media is so liberal. They like to harp on that. They like to shove the racism stories, is the, the, the gun violence because you can look at the FBI's own numbers, and while we have uh, varying degrees of handgun violence for various reasons, whether it's self-defense or police shootings or whatever else, whether they be justified or unjustified, uh, things as far as rifles are concerned, especially military style, and I quote, style rifles, are used in a very statistically low number of crimes. Yes, they are very high profile crime, crimes. Those are ones you always hear about, but especially a fully automatic rifle, you are more likely to be beaten to death with a hammer than you are to be killed with a fully automatic rifle. I believe in the 10th Amendment, and I really will say that the states are left to themselves. I want to give that. Now they're going to go to Chrissy, I guarantee you. That you call the hypocrite uh, an opportunity to respond. Do you want to identify that person? Well, I think if we left it open, we could see how many people smoked pot in high school. <laughs> <laughs> is there somebody you were specifically thinking of? Well, you know, the thing is... He was is talking that, about me. Yeah, I was talking That's about... That's what I thought, so, but well, I wanted let, let me, to say it. Well, I wanted to point, make me... it easier for him, yeah. okay. and I just did. Governor Bush, please. So 40 years ago, I smoked marijuana. Uh, and I admit it. I'm sure that other people might have done it. This is the true confessions of part of the reality TV people. show. My mom's not happy that I just did. <laughs> That's true. But here's the deal. He should have lost his right to vote. He should have been put in jail for 20 years. It's an epidemic of drugs that goes way beyond marijuana. What goes on in Colorado, as far as I'm concerned, that should be a state decision. But if you look at the problem of drugs in this, in this society today, it's a serious problem. Rand, you know this because you're campaigning in New Hampshire like all of us, and you see the epidemic of heroin, it. the overdoses of heroin that's taking place. People's families are, yes, are coming from Afghanistan. Apart. Yeah, it which, is, which, which yeah. is why we're the government to play a <laughs> protecting it. Who's guarding it. those opium fields? Right. Yeah. No was, vacuum there except in uh, some noses and yeah. uh, 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 hypodermic needles, right? Yeah. In, in <clears throat> drug courts to give people a second chance. That's the best way to do this. But let, let me respond. The thing is, is that in Florida, Governor Bush Bush campaigned against medical marijuana. That means that a small child like Morgan Hintz that has 500 seizures a day is failing on nine traditional medications, is not allowed to use cannabis oil, and that if they attempt to do that in Florida, they will take the child away, they will put the parents in jail, yes. and that's what that means. If you're against allowing people to use medical marijuana, you'll actually put them in jail. And right, actually, under the current circumstances, this. kids who that's, had privilege that's like a you lie, go to jail, but the poor kids in our inner, lying, inner cities go to jail. I don't think that's fair, and I think that we need to acknowledge it, and it is hypocritical to still want to put poor people in jail. I don't want to put and, poor people in jail, Rand. Well, you vote, you, here's you, the deal. You, you oppose you put yeah, poor you people in jail. In jail. Yeah. Yeah. When the legislature passed the bill to deal with that very issue. We have more issue, people in jail than China does. They've got four times the population, five times the population. Many people under mandatory minimum. It was the first step. Not his daughter. Place. Yeah, not his daughter, Florida, not him. No. But let's, that means you'll put people in jail. Not, you'll put sick right people now, in jail, but of course, right when he uses it recreationally, it has no issue. consequences. That's true. Go ahead, Christine, I mean, please. You know, I, I enjoyed the interplay. Thank you, gentlemen. I just say this. I'm the prosecutor. You know, 
first off, <laughs> I want to put everybody in jail. Is the first state in the nation that now says if you are a non-violent, oh, non-dealing drug user, that you don't go to jail for your first offense. You go to mandatory treatment. You see, I think we Jake, ought to put mandatory treatment for people over need to be pro-life <laughs> for more than just the time in the womb. It's, 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 it gets a lot tougher it's, when it's they not get out his of the fault. Womb. He doesn't have any control. It's the spoon's fault. The, the spoon right. and fork force its that way into his mouth. <laughs> and we should jail he, is now, a, he is now a result <laughs> of <laughs> having, you know, these dangerous spoons and forks coming out. I think we should ban spoons and forks so we can stop obesity because it's not about self-control. That's right. What about chopsticks and straws, though? Mm. Uh, I need my sushi. <laughs> we should jail the farmers who grew the food for uh, for Chris Christie as well. Oh, you know they Except I think he got Twinkies. I, mean, yeah, I think he ate a they want to jail you if you transport the raw milk across state lines. That's so right. They're already halfway yeah. there. Yeah, yeah, you may respond, and then I'll bring in you, Miss Fiorina. People ask him how he's going to shut down uh, from Subway. Well, and the point is, you don't have to smoke marijuana. And the way that they're using it now in pills and things like that, it's not a gateway drug. It's it's just, would go into Colorado, I get so frustrated with that. And if you're breaking any federal law on marijuana, even though the state law allows it, he would put you in jail. Yes. If right. a young mother is trying to give her child cannabis oil for medical marijuana for seizure treatment, he would put her in jail if it violates federal law. I would let Colorado do what the 10th Amendment says. He can shake said. his head no, but that's this exactly, power, that's Rand Paul is exactly said. right for He said it out of his own mouth. Yep. Yeah. Crime was supposed to be left to the states. Colorado's made their decision, and I don't want the federal government interfering and exactly. putting moms in jail who are simply trying to get medicine for their kids. And, and Senator Paul right. knows that that's Rand Paul's not true. moving to Colorado. In New Jersey, but... we have medical marijuana. Rand Paul's not perfect, but man, he is nailing it in this, this issue. This is not medical marijuana. He's this nailing goes it. much further step beyond. This is recreational use of marijuana. This is much different. And so while he'd like to use a sympathetic story to, to back up his point, it doesn't work. I'm not against medical marijuana. We do it in New Jersey. But I am against the recreational use of marijuana. If he wants to change the federal Why? law, get Congress to about pass the recreational use of Twinkies? And get a president to yeah, sign. Yeah, just think about all the Going marijuana edibles binge. that you're denying yourself, <laughs> Christy. It's not your decision. There's nothing in the Constitution that allows you to do it, Christy. Contradicts the federal law. There's your prohibition He's amendment. He's saying he will send the federal government in and he will enforce right. the federal law. That's not consistent with the Tenth Amendment. It's not consistent with states' rights, and it's not consistent with a conservative vision for the country. I don't think we not should be sending the, the federal police in to arrest a mother and separate them from their child for giving a medicine to their child for seizure. Thank you for watching the show tonight. If you're watching us on YouTube, hit the subscribe button. We certainly appreciate you helping us take it to the next level. And you can also head over to prisonplanet.tv and become a subscriber there. Your subscription will get you instant access to over 18 years worth of high definition content. And you can always share your username and password with up to 20 people at the same time. Comes out to like several cents a day. It's super cheap. Thank you all so much. We'll see you here again Monday, 7 p.m. Central. And all you ISIS people threatening us, hey, we're not a French newspaper, okay? We got people that have taken your asses out in this building right now. We're armed to the teeth, and we're not scared. You got that, you sons of bitches? This is Texas. You want to threaten me, you can go straight to hell. You understand that? Never water yourself down just because someone can't handle you at 100 proof. A clean, toxic-free body is the foundation of true health. Introducing Deep Cleanse by InfoWarsLife.com, a scientifically formulated blend of nanocolloidal zeolites and organic ingredients that aid the body in cleansing chemicals and toxic metals. Using our proprietary multi-step extraction technology, Deep Cleanse is our most affordable all-in-one cleanser. With concentrated organic compounds like cilantro, milk thistle, fulvic acid, orange peel, zeolites, and others, Deep Cleanse doesn't hold back. Instead of buying five, six, or even seven different cleansing products. We use decades old scientific research to put together the Rolls Royce of all-in-one cleansing. Look, there's a reason Deep Cleanse is the only product on the market that uses our proprietary Spigerex herbal processing technique. We use only the highest quality organic herbs backed by serious research and we still bring it to you at the best price out there. If you wish to find Deep Cleanse and experience the all-in-one cleansing, visit InfoWarsLife.com. That's InfoWarsLife.com or call 888-253-3139. 
You are watching the InfoWars Nightly News, which airs 7 p.m. Central at InfoWarsNews.com. And your support is helping us defend liberty worldwide.